Hello everyone, welcome back to some more Biomutant. Okay, so last time we uh, we met with Goop, who needs um, who needed some parts for the Goo Glide. We got the Goo Glide up and running, so we can now use it. Uh, we're gonna need that for the World Eater, the second World Eater, which uh, is shit. I forget the name of it. Was it the Porky Puff? Is what is? Yeah, I think so. And uh, we also liberated a village randomly, and apparently there's also uh, some upgrade benches here, which I don't think we've actually seen thus far, so I just want to kind of check them out and see what happens. Uh, it says weapon and gear upgrade bench available somewhere, and I have no idea where they are. We have a shop here, which um, I don't need to use right now. I've also got a level. Actually, I might as well spend that. Um, let's go for some more vitality. Help up. There we go. That mask is still absolute nightmare fuel. Why am I even wearing that? I have no idea. Um, I'm gonna save my upgrade points for now. What the hell? Did I just? Hang on a minute. Okay, you can kind of jump off walls and shit. I didn't even know you could do that. That's cool. Where the hell's this upgrade bench gonna be? Also, I still love this sword, by the way. I, I absolutely fucking love it. Ah, this could be it. Well, this is the blacksmith. Um, we got a quest over here, which, yeah, again, I'm gonna kind of ignore the side quests for now. Hello. To allow you to Peddler is eager for you to have a look at the wares. I'm ready for business. The doors here are always open for a potential customer. It's also hot as balls, by the way, so I've got my fan on full whack. I bought a new fan. So if you can hear it, I do apologize, but I'm going to try my best to noise cancel that shit because uh, I need, I need airflow. Uh, so here we can buy... You know, handles. Melee weapon parts. But I'm really... I'm not too... It's called a stabby. I'm not too bothered. I think I'm happy with what I've got right now. Um, but it looks like, yeah, there's just so, so many different bits of equipment we can make. Ah, oh, like hammers and shit like that. Two-handed hammers. That'd be cool. But, um, yeah, I really don't need to uh, do any of that shit. That's the Brawlware Broker. And as you can see, it says Upgrade Benches. Where the fuck are they? I don't know. Um, should we try our map, see if there's any indication where it is? Because I... I ain't seeing it right now. Um... Hmm. Actually... Okay, so his thing is on the map now. I wonder if they've patched it, you know. I wonder if they've patched it. I didn't check to see if there was an update. Um, but I can actually see that dude's icon at least. Okay, well, we'll just wander around the village. If we can't find it, we're just gonna move on and carry on with the story. But... Yeah. Um, upgrade bench. Hello? Any upgrade benches? I mean, we might be able to find some items as well. But I'm really not seeing anything. Uh, this could be a bit of an aimless journey. I think I've been in this house. Um, over here, perhaps? No, I've definitely been over here too. I don't know what this upgrade bench is. We're gonna go chat to uh, Gulp about the gum quacks in a minute. But yeah, there is some upgrade benches around somewhere and I don't know where they are. There's my uh, Google Eyes. I really, really love how colorful this game is, by the way. Um, unless the upgrade benches are near Gulp. But is he technically in the village? I guess we'll quickly chat to him. This here is the Sinky Dink, home of Gulp, at the very least. Hey, Gulp! Yeah. 
I like this guy already. He's got a great mustache. Oh, so it's a little fucking island bar. That's what it is. It's like a... Something you'd find on holiday. He's huge. He's pretty sure he's heard of you before, although the details are maybe a little hazy. He wonders if you have something for him to drink. Are you thirsty? Oh, man, look, Gillen points out that he's hungry too, but always thirsty for more. Says you look like you've got a powerful thirst to do something in this world. Good, bad, not really sure, but it seems like you've been drinking in your destiny and liking the flavor. Wonders if you could take the time to help a man slake his own thirst. You'd be doing him a liquid solid. A liquid a solid. Drink, so you know you want to. Either way, he hopes you find a way to wet your whistle before the world comes to an awful dry end and leaves us all thirsting for more. Says life's like a mystery drink. Sometimes it's amazing, and sometimes it's awful. But either way, you can't stop drinking till you're dead. What the fuck is this dialogue? I swear to God, man. Um, try other drinks? Sure, that's the point. But you can't stop trying new ones, or life gets dull. Wants to raise a glass to you getting the world fixed up a bit. Yeah, I'm working on it. Respects how you always try to help, no matter that the world's fate is hard to swallow. Hey, Sees why you joined up with the Myriad. They like a peaceful drink, just like you. Yeah, you, you drink with them? Says he sells them drinks. They mostly suck them down on their own. But who cares about them? Okay. Says you'd be as bummed out as him if you came for the hot stuff. The glug mocker, Nim Him Bibble, and his favorite, Radium Syrup. Mm. That one's even more intoxicating now, aged in truck tankers and all. Radium Come Syrup. On. You're banning it. Without a drink, and Radium Syrup especially, he can't move, much less think, as the power of his mind is directly proportioned to the quantity of syrup he swigs. That's why he's called Gulp. Okay. The drink helps him forget the state the world is in, but it only lasts until tomorrow. The world is still doomed, even if the sun goes up. Okay. Drinking makes you dumb. Do you have a drinking problem? Uh, I'm gonna ask him that. Figures the real problem is finding something to drink. That's what someone with a drinking problem would say. He wants you to know he has other interests, too. He's the Surf Epelago's self-proclaimed ornithologist, for example. Oh! There are Whoa. other ways than a cold drink to relieve stress, even in these dark times. And, fortunately for you, he can help. Watching what is that? Watching flap is calming, but better yet are the ones you can look at and touch, like quacks. Squeezing them is a great way to relax. What the fuck? <laughs> First of all, Pippis flap? <laughs> Sounds like piss flap. Um, you like to squeeze the quacks to relax. Please, please, I'll put the squeeze on- no, uh, tell me more about the gum quacks, please. They're better at floating than flapping, so you should be able to net a few without growing yourself a pair of wings. All right then. Find Gumquack Hollow. How far away is that? Not too far away. Look at, look at this dude sunning himself. How? You're covered in fur, right? How the hell is tanning gonna work? I don't know. Anyway. Um, I suppose it might bleach the fur. Aif, whatever. Uh, quickly grab the waypoints. I really do think my Let's biggest see. issue with this game, apart from its jankiness, is just the sheer amount of dialogue that the... You know, I know I've bitched, I've bitched about it a lot, okay? I'm not gonna keep going on about it, but I must, I must say, it's such a slog to listen to when it seems to be very similar like I said, they say a lot of the same stuff, but just in different ways. But also, just, I think it would have worked a lot better if we still had a narrator who would kind of chime in on important story stuff, like what's going on. 
but leave the dialogue just to the to the people and you can like read it in in dialogue boxes without him reading it. You know what I mean? I think that would have been better. But anyway, um, I still don't know where those workbenches are. I'm gonna have another quick look because it's bugging me. But I have no clue. But uh, I do like this thing. This thing is awesome. Is there a way of making it go faster again? Oh yeah, there we go. Woo! I just love how beautiful the water is. It's just so lush, isn't it? Oh, I'm getting all soggy. Right. Where the fuck are these upgrade benches? I mean, I'm, I guess I'm, I might just have to talk to everyone. What do you want? Hello, says living in the end times might be hard, but... Whatever. Found an unbroken flush stool over yonder. Still works. A toilet? Is that what you mean? You should grab that flush stool before someone scraps it for parts. What's a f what's a f why is it important? Claims it's rare to find one intact and ready to abuse. Ready to abuse? Figures you might find the flush stool in a closet. That's where they used to keep them. A bathroom? Once you find the flush stool, don't drop it. A working flush stool is an amazing thing. Okay. I'll try and find well, I'm not gonna try and find it. I can't be fucked. Where the hell are the upgrade benches? Game. This you said this place has them. I know not what they look like or where they are. I could rest at the fire. I don't need to do that. Um I genuinely don't know where the workbenches are. I'm probably missing them. But, well, obviously, but like... Ooh, ooh, ooh! No, don't... I'm trying to... Did I catch it? Did I... Did I catch the thing? I don't know... <laughs> I don't know what's going on. This is just wasting a lot of time. I'm so annoyed that I can't find these workbenches, though. Like, oh, well, we found an item. Ooh, a twin clamp. That's an armor add-on, okay. Where the fuck? <laughs> the upgrade benches. Wouldn't it make sense for it to be, like, here in the blacksmith place? Apparently not. I don't know. I don't know. I did check over here, didn't I? I ain't got a fucking Scooby-Doo, mate, where these things are. Every there's tons of benches. There's benches everywhere, man. None of them work. None of them are the things I need. I don't know. You guys you guys will probably figure it out before I do. Um, let's have a quick chat with you, I guess. You're the gearware broker. Let's see what you got. Clothes. Anti-biohazard. 90% resistance on that. Holy shit, that's good. Um, a lot of different stuff. Oh, those pant those pants are epic. I'd love to upgrade those. But again, the uh, kind of I don't have that much money really, do I? I could buy everything here, but eh. All right. Where's these upgrade benches? Dude. Shouldn't they be near the, the, the gear broker peeps? I am not seeing anything. I genuinely don't... Oh, God. Where the fuck are they? Why why don't they appear on, like, the map or something? Or... Uh, I don't know where the upgrade benches are. God damn it. Guys, you know, you you'll have to let me know in the comments if you know where they are. But I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go. I've sp I've wasted the whole video so far, pretty much. Let's go find some quacks. Let's do it. Follow the bridge. I'm not gonna bother summoning my mount. I'm just gonna run. Uh, but yeah, I, I heard that there was a patch in the works. I don't know if it's been implemented yet or not. 
But this really is a game that I feel has such potential, it just needs some polish. But I mean, the visuals are so nice. What do we have over here? Oh, another scrap thing. Got some e-waste. And uh, looks like we found the hollow. Uh, am I gonna have to? Br oh, am I gonna have to break into that with my goo glide, which I've completely forgotten about? Uh, can I summon it here, please? Goo glide. You can't select trans. Oh, come on, game. Oh, oh I caught another creature. more light aura. Right, I'm in the water, okay? Can I please summon the Goo Glide? There we go. Nice. Alright, let's see if this works. Can I just slam through it? Oh, we can pull it. Oh, that's what the hook's for. Nice. Here we go. The Quack Hollow. It's just lonely. What? <laughs> Okay, we got a lot of loot in here, some a wreck box, some old world, old world gadgets, ultimate ranged weapon. Oh, more of those tentacle things. Can I, uh... Does this thing have any, like, guns on it? I guess, oh, I could just, sh I can shoot my own guns. Okay. I can't hit the thing. There we go. My gun does not have much accuracy, it seems. Alright, don't have to worry about those guys. And another super dark bunker type place. Let's find the gum quacks. Ooh, a casa hat? Uh, it's not that great, really. Not that great. Mm, I'll take it, though. Oh, we got another probably fiendish puzzle. Oh, shit, this is a new kind of puzzle. Oh, you found a cable connect puzzle. You need to connect the three cables to the different ports to solve the puzzle. Okay. Connect the three cables to the different ports. Each port has positive and or negative value. These values can be seen above and below the port. All right, yep, I see. To successfully complete the puzzle, connect the cable so that they add up to the amount shown at the bottom of the screen. Okay. All right, sounds simple. Um, so that's gonna be like neutral. So that, does that equal two? So if I put that in that, would it be three? Yes, okay. Um, again, not very difficult really. <laughs> but at least it's different. At least they've, we've seen like three different types of puzzles now. And now we can go through there. That was an old world gadget. Definitely not open. Okay. Uh. Do doop. Oh, we got more climbing to do. Oh no! Hang on! Hang on! No, that's a clonk fist. That is a clonk fist. Boom. With a few times. I remembered this time, guys. Are you proud of me? Are you proud? There we go. All the quack. Five we got to catch, apparently. How hard are they going to be to catch, though? Ooh. Are those... Are they... Yeah, they're just ducks swimming about. 
I bet there's other things in that water, though. What do you reckon? Oh my god, that scared the fuck out of me. It's another Huggle. Oh no. Ow. Dodged. I don't think it likes electricity. Ow. Ow. Fucking tail. Dude. Oh my god, I suck. There we go. Oh, that critical hit, though. I am very bad at dodging him. Oh, that death cry. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, that is super fucking easy. The little rubber duckies. I mean, they're not rubber, probably, but still. Where'd the other one go? Oh, did I get them all? I must have caught... Oh, I'm catching as many as I can. Um, oh my god! Wait, are they rubber ducks? Why are these ones not moving? Wait, are they actually rubber ducks that we're gonna... That's why he said you squeeze them. Because they're not actually alive. They're just rubber ducks. What the fuck? Oh my god, that's crazy. Ooh, hello. Is this the uh, the ultimate range weapon? That looks like a 50 caliber rifle or some shit. A bullet spino spino a bullet spino project what? It's an automatic rifle. Oh yeah, let's equip that. Let's try that out. That is the ultimate ranged weapon. What's the ultimate melee one going to be then? And where the hell is it? Uh, new Wung Fu. Ah, because we've got a new weapon, that'd be why. Uh, shoot with your currently equipped weapon. Yeah, 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 yeah. Boom Dove. Oh. Hey, that's cool. Finish the ranged weapon chain with full auto shooting slide. Uh, well, I've got one point. I could get it. What's Maniac Mule? Oh, that looks fucking sick. Auto shooting flip. I think I'm going to save up for that one. That looks very cool. Yeah, we're going to we're gonna stick with this uh, rifle for a little bit. In fact, can I, uh, can I upgrade it in any way? Impressive. Oh wait, I'm not in the right, not in the right menu. Let's see, what can we put on it? Top mod, muffle eye, increases damage a little bit, more critical chance. Uh, grip. Go with the merp, merp. Uh, magazine. Incrementer, that would increase it a good bit. Add some armor piercing, more damage. And I think that's probably all that we're going to be able to do. Because, yeah, we don't have all of the uh, equipment in the world. Oh, no, we can put an ejector on it. Base type. Oh, wow. I, I love this customization. I gotta say... Yeah, I think that's all we're going to be able to do. That is looking pretty fucking beastly. Oh my god, that's epic. I mean, I'm going to have to reload a lot, obviously, but still. Ooh, what's over here? Oh, it's the wreck box. Gonna get more parts for our Goo Glide that I won't know if it's really helping us or not. <laughs> hey! Alright, well, we'll uh, see if we can upgrade that once we leave. 
Unless I have missed the melee weapons somewhere in here. I bet I have, you know. Well, I bet I'll have. Is there going to be anywhere to climb up, though? Well, I'm not too sure. No, I think we'll just leave. I'm pretty happy with my current weapon anyway, but... Obviously, if I can find new ones, that would be exciting. Ah. Another new hat. And bio blobs. Oh, there's the weapon. There it is. Ooh, that does look good. You need to line up the switches so they match. Why do you keep having to tell me that? I oh, know. Uh, that's correct. Just a few moves left. Make them count. Good. That's enough electric current to yeah, yeah, yeah. the actuators. We know. You don't need to say that every single time. This bad boy. It's like a one handed thing. Uh, yep, yeah, one handed slash. Sprinkler smix sharper. Obviously, not as good as what we have currently, but it is one handed. Um, so, I might try that at some point, but we'll. We'll stick with uh, we'll stick with this big boy for now because I love it. Area complete. Let's get the fuck out of here. Give these uh, rubber duckies to goop. Oh, in fact, let's quickly do an upgrade. Um, I think that's the uh, yeah level three. We'll put the new one that we just got. Skidder, that's already equipped, I think. And an end fin. Oh, well, there we go. At least it looks cooler. I really don't know if that makes any difference to the handling or the performance, but... It might do. Might make it go quicker or something. Oh, actually, we do feel... It does feel like we're going quicker. Or is that just me? I really wish there was a stats thing that I could tell. Just to you know, confirm that, you know? Out for the mines. And. Alright, I got your stuff. Gulp says he'll bibble anything once, as long as it's drink alicious, even rocket fuel. He once mixed up some tankers and drank that. It was a real lift off. That leads him to the bottom of that particular bottle. Radium syrup. If only he could find a tanker truck to empty. He's not in a state to go looking, so he's counting on you to help. Go find him a tanker truck and bring back some of that precious radium syrup. Please. Ah, oh, okay. All right. You shouldn't be without that. Making you smarter would be useful. Thinks you're not the only one who... What were we talking about again? Oh my god, Gulp. Um, that's a side quest? Wait. Hang on a minute. Hang on a minute. Why Why is this a side quest if we need... Do we need to do this? Gulp says he didn't expect to see you back so soon. Um, I can't stay. I guess we have to do this. Let me check the... Let me check my journal. Um... Tree of Life, defeat all four world eaters, capture the rival outpost, not going to do that. Decide who will go in the Ark. That's a weird thing, yeah. Uh, stir up the moth nest. We were in, we were kind of in the middle of doing that. Return to Goop. The Goop Glide Special. I have returned to Goop. I've just done it. I've just returned to him. Maybe I need to be like... Tracking the quest? Gulp says he didn't expect to see you back so soon. I know that you know something more. Happy you're no longer so shy. Good to have you Can you fill me in on what I'm missing? Says they used to trade with an outpost in a bunker near the valley, 
I'm confused. Why? Gulp says he didn't expect to see you back so soon. I'm so confused. What? Gulp begs you to find Pike. So he does need the drink, right? But for some reason, the main quest. This isn't part of the main quest. I'm so confused. It just says, return to Goop. I have just returned to Goop. But, so surely this should now say, like, go find the drink. But the, that's a side quest. I'm so confused. I guess we're gonna have to go do this. Well, what? I don't think it's sunbathing weather anymore, mate. You're getting piss wet through. Right, let's go do this. It is not always clear <laughs> what the game wants you to do. Oh, we got another uh, green leaf thing. Although that is over the river, fuck it. I'm not gonna bother. Looks like we're going back into a lovely, dark, dingy, damp place again. Down the manhole. And another side quest, dude. I'm gonna bother with you. I'm gonna search these cars, though. Another hat. Another hat! This gutway has centuries of old waste. Lovely. Progress through the sewer. There's a bioblob container, some superb loot. And yep, some dudes to kill. Oh, we missed him. That would have been epic if we caught him with that. Burn, bitches. Ah, this new gun. Oh, dude. Doesn't do much damage, obviously, but... That spin, though. And gosh. Is that all of them? I think so. Yeah, the combat is still pretty fun, but it... I, I must say, I do find myself using the same moves over and over and over and over and over and over and over. A grip slick. Hmm. Yeah, hopefully this side quest won't take too long. Open the sewage gate. Great. Just great. Oh, God. Ow. Oh, yeah, you have to reload really, really often with this thing. Ah, mushroom. Where's he gone? Where's he? Oh my god. It's so hard to keep track of him. That is fun though. That is quite fun. <laughs> Bio points. Quite done. There you go. <laughs> Did I electrocute it? And it was going like. Zzz. All right, give me that bio blob. Five of those, six of those now. I should really spend that. Um, 
Should I get some more resistance upgrades, or maybe... I thought, yeah, I can't even afford any more of those right now. I might just upgrade my resistances a little bit. I've got 84% biohazard right now. That's pretty good. Get up to 94. Some uh, anti-cold, anti-heat. Where's this loot going to be? Oh, that's a big boy! What tribe is that? I have no idea. Find a way to raise the sunken truck. Hey guys! Oh, they got turrets. I need to get rid of those turrets. Also, there's fuel over here. Yes! Please tell me that's actually lighting up the... Yeah, it must be. There we go. I love sliding beneath them. Ooh, flipping about! Flipping about! Whoa! That dodge, though. Yes! I love it when they get electrocuted. Slide in between his legs is awesome. You may see just you. Obviously, I've not really kitted out my guy to be very strong with his magic stuff, so it, it never does really too much damage. It's just fun. It's just fun to use. But uh, I'm really not taking much damage from these guys. I'm either super OP with my gear or my level, or... Then again, I'm only like... I'm only two levels above them. So maybe the game is just a little bit easy. Oh no, I'm three levels above them. Okay. So I might be slightly overleveled. Alright, how do I get this, uh... Oh, I'm gonna have to do the... thing again, aren't I? Climbing up top. Uh... Am I gonna be able to make this? Oh, dude! Ah, oh, we can jump up here, that's okay. Oh, it's a quick... I keep on forgetting. No, wrong button. Ugh. Well, there we go. Find the radium syrup. Flex those smart muscles and open the hatch. Uh-huh. Just Oops. a few moves left. Make them I nearly messed that up. That should be enough glow juice for two. Alright. Now we return to Gulp and hopefully we progress the story. I really think this should have probably been a main story quest. I don't know why it was a side quest, but anyway. Uh, how do I get out? Is there a quicker way out? I'm gonna have to retrace my steps. Or we don't know. Yeah, probably just run all the way back out. It really, it really wasn't a big area. Yeah, I, there is some superb loot I've missed. Yeah. Where did I even come from? Did I come from that way or did I come from this way? This might be where the loot is. Oh, hello. Yep, there it is. Oh, I skipped it. I don't know what I picked up. Fuck. Fuck. A backpack? Have we got a backpack equipped? Hang on a minute. 
Do we even have a backpack equipped? No, we don't. No, we don't. We've already got one. Oh my god, that's huge. Damn, dude. Well, a little bit more armor. There we go. That looks ridiculous on us, though. I like seeing my sword in all its glory. I mean, I can still see the sword. It's fucking huge. But still. Right. Um, Crap, how do I get out of here? I wonder, actually, can I use the mushroom? Oh my god, I can use the mushroom. Ha! Huh. I could probably have gotten up there without it, but still. That's cool. Oh, I like that. That would be cool if, the, if they've designed the game where that ability, if you unlock it, you can access some hidden areas and stuff. I don't know if that is the case, but that would be kind of interesting. Right. Gulp. In fact, I can just fast travel. I can fast travel. Hey, yo, thumb up. Superang Hunt Gulp says he wants to take you with him on a super funny happy slide. <laughs> Sharing is caring, and one drink for two is just right. Okay. Gulp says seeing your face is like seeing his own reflection at the bottom of a glass. It never gets old. I meet this very He's been looking forward to a rendezvous. Rendezvous! And it's on you to make it happen. There's even a chance the syrup is more intoxicating now from being aged in a radiated tanker. I'll give it a kick, all right. He's sure there are even more tanker trucks with radium syrup out there waiting to be emptied. Oh, wait. Is this part of another... So, hang on. Blesses your heart for doing your part. Cheers when you're here. I don't want That's to go find so you more booze. Right. Seriously, you like the shine. You just don't want anyone to get a good look at you. Uh, dark is stylish. <laughs> Lie to yourself all you like, darling. These guys are so weird. Hey, like what? Gulp <laughs> says drinking shouldn't keep you from thinking. He wonders what's on your mind. Seem. It seems like there's more I need to know. Maybe the time has come for you to go see the Lotus Tribe. The Lotus Tribe? Says you'll meet again. But what about the World Eater? I thought you were going to help me. Says drinking shouldn't keep you from thinking. Oh my god. So that was. Was that just a side quest? I didn't need to do that? The drink will defeat Gulper's own game. No, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on a minute. Journal. Main quest, right? You're going to need two things to take on the triple-headed Porky Puff. A way to get to it, which we've got. Um, and a way to distract it, which we've picked up. But... Once it's ready, you need gulp, Gulp's local to help locate Gum... We, right, we've done that, yeah, and it's, it's telling me... It's telling me to return to Goop. Yeah? Right. I've I'm tracking that quest. Oh wait, hang on. Oh, that's Gulp! Oh no! Why do they have such similar fucking names? Goop and fucking Gulp. I was supposed to go back to Oh, I didn't need to do that side quest. I bet you guys were screaming at me. Fuck sake. Oh my god. I didn't need to do that side quest. Oh, we got some stuff out of it, I guess. Where's my Google light gone? Ah, uh, uh, <laughs> Goop. It probably would have helped if I'd actually looked at the, where the tracker was. Oh, man. Oh, well, at least we got some stuff, right? It's not wasted. Just wasn't pertinent to the story, that's all. Never mind. We got the we got the ducks. And we got some some gear and shit like that. And some XP. 
Ah, oh, my div. I know it was me blaming the game. No, nope, I just didn't pay attention. Goop and Gulp are very similar names, okay, guys? Let's see if he can kit this thing out, and then we can go take on a World Eater. Although that'll be next time, I'm guessing. He shoved up his ass? That's enough quacks to sustain the Googlide flipper with infinite ammunition. Goop says he was there when the Porky Puff took out of Date's leg, so this World Eater has made it personal. Oh, another flashback. I mean, this thing looks pretty terrifying. After that, Out of Date started using his head instead of his legs and came up with the plan on how to best make a stand against the World Eaters, and it wasn't by foot. He seems happy to talk. Okay, um... I can't remember what to do next. You need to help Goop defeat the Porky Puff before it destroys the southeast route. Okay. Glad to see you out and moving about in the daylight. I don't want you to keep you any longer. You should... He seems happy to I must be on my way. Understand. The Eastern World Eater. All right, defeat the Porky Puff. Okay, cool, right. So I think, chaps, that is what we are going to do next time. Thank you very much for watching, for those of you who are. I appreciate it. Um, again, still not 100% sure if we're going to end up finishing this or not. It, it really does depend on if I can uh, find time for this. I'm not going to prioritize it uh, over some newer stuff that I'm doing. Um, but I will definitely try and get videos out of this or out on this as often as I can. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for everyone who is following this series along. And uh, I will see you next time, where hopefully I won't get confused about people's names and who I need to talk to for quests. I probably will. Ooh, another shrine. Quick, we'll grab this. Alrighty. Yep, take care, everyone. I will see you next time. Bye-bye for now.